What's up guys, it's Sean. So today I'm going to show you guys some things that you could use for your stream to make it better. Um, I'll start with settings, I guess, for OBS. Um, I use OBS Classic to stream because I find it's better than OBS Studio. I have a lot of problems with OBS Studio and streaming, but I do use OBS Studio for recording as I am now because it seems better for recording but worse for streaming. So OBS Classic for streaming, in my opinion. So. For encoding, these are my settings. For broadcast settings, uh, that's not relevant. Video, these are my settings. Audio. Advanced, these are my settings. And you guys could pause on those and copy my settings. And the other things I want to show you guys are OnkBot, which is a really good bot for streaming on Twitch. It has a lot of features. I'll open up mine. Okay. So you can log into your streamer account and your bot account and you can go to your dashboard. You can chat as your bot or your streamer account. On your dashboard you can change the title and everything. You can do commercials, hosting, uh, today's things, followers, raiders, hosts, custom commands, timers, so your bot says something at times, or does something at times, quotes, giveaways, sound effects, um, currency, so you could do uh, chat games, custom ranks based on currency or time watched. Um, you can do heists, you can do betting, polls, here's my game that I use, I use heist, a lot of streamers used to use heist, I don't know if they still do. Um, event system, I've never messed with this, on speak event system, I'm not sure what this does, song request, this works really good. Um, not sure what this is. Oh, it's just a queue. So if you want to make a queue of like players that want to play with you, then this is the place to do it. And some other settings. So that's OnkBot. That's the first thing I wanted to show you. It's a really nice bot. And now Twitch alerts. So you have all your alerts popping up on your stream when people follow and donate and stuff like that. I'll show you how it works. So basically you just go to this website, you set it up, you need CLR browser in OBS, and then you're just gonna make a CLR browser right here. And then you're going to go here, go to alert box, and then you're gonna copy this link and put it in your CLR browser. And so what it'll do, I'll show you. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to turn off my webcam. Alright. So when people follow, it'll... What is this? How do I test it? Oh, here we go. They get little notifications. Donation. Hosting. Hosting. Donation. This is a test donation for $49. Alright. The sounds are behind. I'm done. Alright. So those are the things I want to show you guys for streaming. Um, these things are really useful if you want like an engaging stream. Or just to be able to have some cool extra features. Um, overlays are nice too. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope this helped you. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.